All right, everyone, today I have this absolutely gorgeous carbonized gray 2023 F-150. This one is in the Highline 302A XLT series. It's got a bunch of nice upgrades done to it. Let's take a look at it together. The first thing that really stands out are these gorgeous all black 20 inch fuel rims wrapped in KO2 BF Goodrich all-terrain tires, which are great year round and even have the mountain snowflake on them. My personal favorite tire that I run myself. Then under the hood of this one is the 5 liter Coyote V8. That engine has been around for a while. They run it in the Mustang and everyone loves it. It's got the 10 speed transmission with it. Then you have these amazing LED headlights that are fully automatic, set it and forget it, including auto high beams. LED fog lights complement those. This has the full sport package, which gives you all the matching bumpers on it. Then you have front tow hooks and it's protected by an AeroSkin front hood deflector and even has 3M protection on the hood, the fenders, the bumper, the A pillars, the roof line. It is ready to go, saving you from rocks, which is awesome. Speak also has a four pedestrian system detection, um, which basically means if somebody steps out in front of you last minute, you don't have time to put your foot on the brake, it'll do that for you. That saves lives and saves some money on insurance. You see the F-150 badging on the side there. These mirrors are the upgraded tow style mirror. Again, something I personally run, love that style of mirror. And this vehicle does have the max trailer tow package, giving you the maximum ability for this configuration to tow. These mirrors are a extendable mirror. They can fold in, they have dual convex, and they have a blind spot system, so that lights up when somebody's in your blind spot. To get in or out of this truck, you can just put your code inside here and it'll unlock. You can also put your hand inside the door handle to sense the heat from your hands and unlock. Press this little button right here to lock it or use this key fob with unlock, lock, remote start. You can undo your tailgate from there or alarm or you can download the Ford Pass system and do that anywhere in the world from your smartphone. All for free with no subscription. Thank you Ford. Platform running boards make it nice and easy to get in. Didn't mention, but you do have these gator back, no drill F-150 mud flaps, again, saving the paint on the side. Tinted back windows look fantastic. Open up this back door and you get your first look at this sport interior. Love the accent stitching that's been done. This is actually a little map of Detroit in here. And this has the upgraded Bang & Olsen stereo system, which sounds pretty nice inside. In the back seat, you have all kinds of room. The floor has been protected by an all weather mat very comfortable seats which do fold up and give you that totally flat floor that Ford is known so famously for. Then you do have 12 volt power supply, inverted power supply and USB-C hookups, cup holders and if you look up top a huge panoramic sunroof with power shade letting in all kinds of natural light. As we come to the back here uh, you do have your uh, capless easy fuel setup with the upgraded 136 liter fuel tank. This is the six and a half foot box giving you all kinds of space to put things in. And then you do have these color match bumpers which have the sensors inside. And we've got a backup camera here as well, making it nice and easy to back up and hook onto things. Seven pin and four pin wiring for trailers with your tow package there. Press this button twice and our tailgate is gonna come down for us. A little bit of snow in the box of this one, but you can see it does have a spray and liner. And there is an inverted power supply right there. We also have LED lighting and tie downs which are removable power sliding rear window in the back, which is also fully tinted and heated. And then on the tailgate, you actually have C-channel spots so that you're doing woodwork off the back, you got a place to clamp those down. We have extended strap holder from one side to the other, which also duals as a bottle cap opener from the bottom, which is nice. I forgot to mention on the front of this truck, it is leveled as well. So the front does sit equal with the back as a two inch level, it's been installed open up the driver's door and I always like to show the capacity stickers here let's give you a little look at that and then on the driver's door another one of those nice little maps from Detroit we've got our power locks our power mirrors and power window controls again bang and Olsen stereo system in this one and you see that speaker right there on the dash you've got really nice materials here we've got buttons for underneath the mirrors you've got lighting Put our tailgate down, set it and forget it headlights. This does your fog light, cargo lamp and interior dimmer switches, power adjustable pedals and emergency brake. You can unlatch the steering column. It'll go in and out or up and down. These super comfortable captain's chairs are 10 way power and heated and they are just comfortable to sit in. Let's climb inside. 
All right, now that we're inside the truck, we're just gonna go ahead and hit this push button start. That is gonna fire this one up. Oh, forgot to mention, outside, this does have the Magnaflow exhaust system upgrade. Don't know if you can hear that or not, but with that five liter Coyote, it sounds fantastic. Uh, inside this display, you do have a digital speedometer and a bunch of other information. As you can see, we're low on windshield wash fluid right now, and it tells you that. Love these little features. On the uh, steering wheel, you have cruise control, volume controls, and voice recognition. We also have uh, controls for that little display up top, as well as phone and stereo controls here. Another Bang & Olsen stereo speaker and a place to put things. A big 12-inch screen display that I love. Some buttons above, engine auto off. This is for our backup camera. And we've got four-way flashers and traction control. Inside of this display, we have all kinds of information and a navigation system which can be connected to Ford for real-time traffic updates, as well as weather and a bunch of other information that you can get. Audio systems, you do have satellite radio as well as Bluetooth streaming, AM and FM, and because of the Sync 4, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto wireless, which is awesome. That means that you can connect your smartphone. This becomes your smartphone, your apps from your phone. Even if you want to use Google Maps or Apple Maps can all come up here and I just love it for Spotify or audiobooks or any of that kind of thing. Then you do have some more buttons down here, phone controls. You can set a favorites icon, make sure you're hooked up to the app that comes with the vehicle and go into your settings and features. Features does have a couple of cool things, including zone lighting. You can actually turn the whole outside of this truck into one big flashlight. Just hit this button here and pick which side we'd like to light up. Love the zone lighting feature. Great in the winter when you have a lot of darkness. Volume controls for our stereo, dual climate control, my side and my passenger side, heated seats on both sides, and we can set an auto zone control. Our fan control is nice and easy. Pocket to put things with USB and USB-C hookups in there. Our 10 speed automatic transmission shifter, which you can put to a manual mode and shift up and down with this plus and minus. Or we can press this button right here and fold that right out of the way. This has the upgraded work surface. So then we can work that out. We've got a place to work from. Awesome. Fold that back up. On the side here, we do have Pro Trailer Backup Assist. You can back up using just this knob to steer the vehicle. Trailer Brake Controller. And then our four-wheel drive. Two high, four high, four low. Locking rear differential and drive modes. What are drive modes? Well, when we scroll through this, you'll see we can go to Tow Haul, Eco, Sport, or we can go the other direction. And we can go into Slippery, Deep Snow and Sand, or mud and ruts. So it just controls the parameters of the engine, the shift points, as well as the traction control on the vehicle. Uh, sport happens to be probably my favorite one. And uh, you can get a little more out of the exhaust when you're in sport. That sounds fantastic. On this side, we've got 12 volt power supply, inverted power supply, two glove boxes. Hit this button to open the top one. Electrochromatic auto dimming mirror, some map lights, controls for that power sunroof and power shade. Control for your back sliding window. Speaking of shades, you put your sunglasses in here. That is this beautiful carbonized gray 2023 F-150. Thanks a lot for watching this video. Do me a huge favor and click subscribe to this channel. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, go ahead and click that bell icon. You'll be notified every time I make a video. Thanks everyone and have a great day.